This is her. This is the specimen of human herd. So what are the different groups in herd? You know, there is one C separate group. This is known as the atrioventricular group. In between the atrium part and the ventricle part, there is one group and this is C separate, which is actually why this one is C separate. See, look at this set. From this part, this one is coming, this group is coming. So from this area, this one is the left auricle. From this part, this one is coming posteriorly. And in this area anteriorly also, this one is right side also coming, right anteriorly. So in this area, this is deferred. That's why this is like this step. Can you focus? This one is C separate. Okay, this one is C separate. So this one is the atrioventricular group. So what is the name? This part is the right, left, left. Anterior atrioventricular groove. This part is the posterior atrioventricular groove, and this one is the right atrioventricular groove. Okay. Now there is one in between the ventricles. In between the ventricle, there is one septum. Under it, so what happened in the septum? There is one also groove. So this one anteriorly, this one focus here so this one is known as the anterior interventricular groove and posteriorly you will get posterior interventricular groove okay so this one anterior this one is the posterior interventricular groove that means this one is the right ventricle this one is the left ventricle okay now come to the atrium in between this atrium we know this one is the right atrium which opens the supravena gopha this one is the supravena gopha and this one is the infravena gopha that means this one is the right atrium and where the four where the four pulmonary veins then opens here that coming to the both side from the left side lung and from the right side lung also they are coming so what happened they, they open to the left atrium so there coming definitely this part will be the left atrium in this area above the posterior atrial ventricular group so this part so in between the right and left in between the right and left there is definitely one group yes this is you can see this one will be the group this group is known as the posterior interatrial groove just inside it you'll get the inside it you'll get the interatrial septum okay now interventricular groove interatrial groove atrioventricular groove i have told so now posteriorly if you see where they joins in a part this posterior interventricular posterior interatrial and posterior part of the atrioventricular groove in this area they join and this part is known as the crux of heart okay what are the artery goes along this groove you have to know so first two arteries mainly two arteries one is the right coronary artery they arises from the aorta right side and one is the left coronary artery goes this way left side left atrioventricular group 